hey smart watches now there are literally hundreds of options if you want to buy a smart watch right from budget series to mid ranges to all the way premium smart watches few of them start from as much as maybe 900 rupees less than 1000 rupees and they go all the way up to 1 lakh rupees plus however most of the consumers are the ones who want to buy a decent smart watch that has good screen good battery uh, good accuracy in terms of fitness which can help you track your sport activities which can also look good in your hand it's comfortable and from a very good brand so most of you have a requirement of having a smart watch which is less than 5000 rupees and there we go samsung scores right there this is galaxy fit 3 now the name suggests that this is a fitness band but this can actually replace your smartwatch how why and when let's find out let us begin with the unboxing but let me tell you i have already used this product for about 2 weeks now and i have just repacked this so that i can show you the unboxing experience and there you go that's how it looks like first you can take the watch out which looks absolutely stunning and there is some paperwork inside over here some warranty cards and paperwork inside nothing else absolutely and on this side you would see a charging cable now this is a magnetic charging cable and on the other end there is type c port so this is a very good addition because all the new chargers are type c uh, chargers so you can simply plug it and charge your device let us see how to connect this uh, charger so it's pretty simple as i said it is magnetic so plug and play there we go it's quite strong it holds the watch very well and we will show you the charging details later let's get into the watch itself So as I said I have already used this watch for about a couple of weeks and uh, I have configured this entirely um, so I'm going to wear this and I'm going to start uh, sharing my experience with you Now one interesting thing to remember is when you wear the watch you'll have to uh, keep it a little loose because the strap actually goes back inside and this kind of gives you a very flushed look like a very clean look uh, I have ordered a white color because well I prefer this uh, there are other options also like the gray one Uh, which is also quite good. Uh, it gives you a torch, which basically uh, uh, is your display uh, with full brightness that you can use it as a torch. There is also a mode for water control. For example, if your phone, um, uh, if you're using your phone for uh, any of the swimming or uh, activity related to water to avoid accidental touch, there is this button. So you just have to long press this. When I raise the hand, the display comes on, and then uh, if it goes off uh, at its time, you can just click on the screen and it goes on again so these are the few settings that i have set already now when you slide down there is a power button there is a do not disturb button there is a, a button which is always on display for you uh, of course this consumes a lot of battery so i prefer turning this off this is on always on display uh, not my taste so i'm going to turn this off again uh, there is a quick settings button on this side there is a button for uh, mute and vibrate and you know basically there is no speaker on this so this would keep your uh, a smart watch or a fit band on uh, uh, vibration mode uh, well on your if you swipe right there are different tiles for example your uh, steps control there is music control on this now if your phone is connected you can simply uh, control your music from here you can also control your volume from here when it is connected uh, there is a sports mode on this there is also a sleep mode um, there is weather and you have got calendar over here which can also show you uh your basic uh, activities and you know events uh, on that particular day um there is heart rate monitor on this now you can also add different tiles like alarm timer blood oxygen etc etc well i don't use them so often so i prefer them turned off in any case so that's that's all the tiles that you have got which are can also be customized now when you swipe in the reverse direction you get the ba basic menu now these are like your apps which are in built you cannot install new apps and you will want notice that you know all these uh, icons they actually look like samsung one ui so this is a specific ui designed for this watch 
and uh, as I said, you know, uh, it, it goes very well with any Samsung phone. Now, if you swipe left, you would go to a quick notification. If you don't want to see a notification, you can simply clear them from here. So all your notifications, whether it is WhatsApp or any phone, SMS, calls, everything, you would see them right here when you swipe left. Now, it's clear, so it's showing no notifications. If you swipe right, you will see those tiles again. So these are the basic controls. Uh, and if you want to go back to your home screen, you can always click the hard button, which is on the right side. There's only one button on the entire watch. There is nothing else. The watch is absolutely clean otherwise. When you click this twice, uh, it quickly takes you to your uh, sports menu. Now, whatever activity you want to do, you can select from here and then you can quickly start that. Now, what I generally use this for is weight machines. Uh, if I'm at the gym, I would simply turn this on and of course turn this off when I am finished my workout. And in the end, it would tell me how many calories I have burnt, which of course I can look at my app also. So that's the basic uh, menu, which I would like to show you on uh, this particular device. Now we would like to connect this device with our uh, phone and show you the actual uh, usage. Before that, let's uh, turn this off, swipe right and finish. So yeah, while I spoke so much, I only burnt two calories anyway. So that's how it is. Uh, I hope you like the look of this smartwatch overall. You would basically need two apps to run this uh, device successfully on your phone. Now these apps can be downloaded on all Android phones. You don't really need to have uh, a Samsung phone. Uh, the first one is of course wearable. On this, you can connect your Samsung Buds or uh, your fitness band or any Samsung uh, wearable device. Now, if you go to watch faces, that's your first menu. You've got hundreds of uh, watch faces and you know what each watch face has got multiple color schemes like this so that's a lot of customization uh, if you see you know there's animal print there's minimal prints there's digital watch menu there is uh, this natural cloud menu there is minimal amoled menu and uh, a, a quick cool one like this there's some fitness uh, mode menu as well uh, i like this one a lot but particularly i have i used to use this before changing my wallpaper uh, so yeah, I don't want to get into each and every detail of uh, these watch faces, but you can see there are so many. I prefer this uh, watch face in particular because this is minimal. Uh, this is very suitable for AMOLED as well. So and also very informative, like it gives me all the basic information. Uh, now there is app screen. Now what is the sequence you would want to have? For example, if you want media controller before this menu, you can simply hold and drag and then save in the end. So this is the tiles menu uh, basically which shows you all the tiles that you have this is the sequence on my uh, fitness band right now if i don't want any particular thing i can disable that from here now later if i want that particular thing i can simply click on this and it will be right there if i want to add this if i want to add this i can add up to 10 different tiles these are the overall uh, uh, positions that you've got you can of course change and uh, uh, re arrange them according to your taste all right now there is a band setting as well which basically gives you different modes uh, it also gives you um, display control for example the screen on time the brightness and as you control life uh, it, it changes on your smartwatch when it is connected uh, there is weather control where you can add location you of course cannot add anything new as i said this is its own ui but of course there is a lot to play around and you know uh, set the watch according to your taste and customize it as much as you can there's another thing called find my band now when you start this it would vibrate and it doesn't make any noise because there's no speaker in built on the smartwatch uh, but yeah when you find it you can simply press on this and yeah that's it so that's a handy feature to have i'm not sure how much with the vibration makes sense if you really lost it but having something is always better than having nothing so that's the number one app that you want to use the second app is held now this has nothing to do with the connectivity but of course it has to do a lot with your health and uh, fitness parameters because this is a fitness band so yeah right up there there is a uh, display which shows you how many calories you have burnt i just showed an example so that's displaying right here these are the number of steps number of minutes active in the day and the total calories burnt today uh, you can change your target steps uh, every day uh, and also, you know, you can add uh, uh, new thing. For example, if you're into hiking or if you're into biking or if you prefer walking or treadmill or whatever it is, 
you can simply add there i don't do any of those these are the only two things that i hardly do anyway so i have added them over here uh, the total workouts in this week was uh, so and so there's a sleep coaching as well and the sleep meter is actually quite accurate uh, now when you click on this it shows you your overall uh, sleep tracker for each day now if i go to 9th april for example uh, it shows i slept less and it needs attention the sleep score is only 46 because i slept at 3:29 am and i woke up at 8:41 and it also shows you um, your uh, sleep stage you know deep sleep and light sleep etc etc like any other band but this is quite accurate it also detects your snoring and can recommend you uh, exercises accordingly uh you can of course keep adding uh, your food habits to it uh you can add your weight uh, height etc which can show you your uh, body mass index uh, it also gives you stress tests and so many other things for example uh, water reminders and uh, how much water you want to consume every day you can set target and keep adding it so that's that thing and the last one is blood oxygen control i don't really use it so much and i suggest don't use it don't rely for health purpose it's a good feature to have but it should not be used for any medicinal purposes um now if you come down there is a heart rate monitor uh, if you click on this of course it would start monitoring and then you can of course set whether you want to monitor every day or every 10 minutes or not at all i have kept this uh, at not at all because you know i don't want to monitor my heart rate every time i just do it when i am at the gym otherwise i keep it left you know i just left it leave it open um in the end uh, coming to the battery life the battery life on this is actually very very nice uh, you can see Uh, it is 100% charged right now uh, it takes about an hour to go from 0 to 100 using any samsung charger type c with standard 10 watt output or more than that uh, and it lasts 10 days easily in my case it has been lasting 10 days exactly and the company uh, the company however claims 13 days but to me 10 days without any problem i've been living with it okay so now coming to the million dollar question should you get it I would say if you're looking for a smartwatch under 5000 rupees in today's state there is nothing better than this because this is not just a fitness band it also comes from a brand like Samsung which is uh, having a very good user interface there are no bugs whatsoever the controls are minimum you cannot add new things to it but also you cannot go wrong with it the accuracy is nice you know most of the bands in this range are quite gimmicky uh, the readings are not that accurate but this is really good in terms of accuracy this is good in terms of battery the comfort is absolutely fantastic i mean 10 on 10 for the strap for the comfort for the color for the size i can easily sleep with it because it's also a sleep tracker for me so there's no harm wearing it sleeping all day all night um it's also good for you know your sport activities if you're out it has got ip Uh, rating so you know you can always use it for swimming purposes as well so this makes it an all rounder of course this is not as good as uh, samsung watch which cost more than 20000 rupees this is one fourth of that price but it gives a lot more than the one fourth amount that they charge you for uh, for example there are watches from firebolt there is of course boat and uh, there is crossbeat and so many other watch companies these days but none of them are accurate most of the features in those watches are gimmicky this one does not feel gimmicky at all so that's why i rate this watch above the other watches uh, that's my number one reason for you to buy this my number two reason of course is the looks and the comfort no other watch would be as comfortable as this i can tell you that and the number three reason to buy this watch is because it comes from samsung so you will get timely updates you will get a good ui it does feel like uh Samsung uh One UI in built in this watch with all those icons uh and my number four reason for you to buy this watch is if you have got a Samsung phone you have to have this you should not buy any other uh smart watch because Samsung to Samsung connectivity is awesome and uh, it does feel like one family same ecosystem however if you want more than this if you want more features even if they are not that accurate and even if they are gimmicky if you can live with it then might as well you can go for a firebolt or a boat or any other apart from this which can save you a couple of thousand rupees because they are available for maybe 3000 rupees uh this with discount however you can get for 4.5k inr uh so if your budget is up to that and if you're looking for a good company a good smart watch that's going to last you long you should buy this thank you well 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 before i go back uh please do like share subscribe because it's a new channel i'm trying to bring a lot of new videos and your subscription kind of motivates me it encourages me to buy new things 
because none of them are sponsored so i can buy new stuff and i can review them very naturally as natural as this so that you can understand uh, how is how it's gonna look like on you how are you gonna experience it so the pre-experience i can give you if you subscribe thank you